In Adopt Me, the goal is to collect pets. 334 pets currently exist. What if I told you I could make 100 new pets in only one minute with the power of AI? AI stands for Artificial Intelligence, a piece of software trained to go and create new Adopt Me pets. Let's try it out. The AI is trained using images and goes and creates something in the style of what you want. For example, a hand-drawn pet. Type what I want out, press remix, and the power of the AI will start to go and create my work. By the end of this video, I'm gonna train the AI to go and recreate Adopt Me Pets, to go and invent some pets that don't even exist, such as spiders, aliens, and new April Fool's pets. Is the example, I asked for it to draw a tiger holding a cookie in a certain art style. Now, let's try something else. You can actually go and upload images onto this. The software is called Astroblox, and they gave me exclusive access to go and test out new features, such as uploading images. So thanks to them for also sponsoring today's video. Let's turn this gorgeous tree kangaroo from Adopt Me into a new style. This mod has literally turned the tree kangaroo from Adopt Me into an anime art style. And people are using this technique to go and make icons for their Roblox games. Before and after. This is going to be interesting. So to create my own Adopt Me Pets, we have to train the AI to know what an Adopt Me Pet is. To do so, I have to upload 5 to 30 images so the AI can analyze what an Adopt Me Pet looks like. I've provided pictures of all of the brand new pets in the new A. Also, this is private so Adopt Me doesn't sue me. It will now take 10 minutes for the AI to go and learn from the images to allow me to create my own pets. Let's test this, an alien in the style of Adopt Me. Now, this is the first thing that it's given me, and I guess it does actually look like an Adopt Me styled pet, as it's got the same styled eyes. It's also given me this one, which I think is also pretty funny, and looks like an alien, but Adopt Me version. There's a button here that says, give me similar images. By doing so, it's gone and generated me four new variations of this pet. And this one actually looks real. So, how do we go and make this into Adopt Me? Well, let's simply copy the image and place it into a photo editing software. Now, with a few clicks, we have a pretty realistic looking Adopt Me update. Now, if anyone just saw this, they would probably think that this is a real Adopt Me Alien update that is coming into the game. Meanwhile, a little robot just made it in 60 seconds. Adopt Me doesn't have a spider pet, so let's make one. First attempt looks pretty interesting. This is indeed a spider in the style of Adopt Me, but I think it has a few too many legs and kind of looks like a wheel. I, I don't know, something just seems odd about this. I'm now going to ask for a rainbow cat in the style of Adopt Me, and I hope this looks good. Oh my word, it has actually given me a rainbow cat in the style of Adopt Me. Not only has it given me one, it's actually given me like tons of different little cute variations, including this, which is amazing. This, which is like futuristic and uh, straight up like a real life rainbow cat. This looks like a real Adopt Me pet, so I'm gonna make four new variations. To do so, just click this little button, and it will literally make me pets. Again, just take it into any software, put a pet here, stick a bit of text there, and ta-da, you now have the Rainbow Cat Adopt Me update. Now we're gonna go spooky and ask for a ghost. Whoa, the outcomes actually look like real pets. I don't know how this is a ghost. But what is this? This actually looks like what a ghost would kind of look like in Adopt Me. This is, this is interesting. This is actually a ghost from Adopt Me. This has like all of the right styles. Um, this one, maybe not so. This one, I don't know what I'm looking at. But this, this looks like an actual Adopt Me pet. I just don't know what. And this just genuinely does look like a real Adopt Me pet. So if you want some Halloween stuff, then uh, here we go. I guess we can make a ghost pet. I asked for a mythical animal in the style of Adopt Me and it's given me this. I don't know what animal this is, but I kind of love it. It's made me four variations. This one looks like it's got a giraffe body and like antlers and stuff. Honestly, I don't know what this is, but it looks great. Like all four of these are really interesting. 
Here we go. Here is the new pets update. This just actually could be passed off as real at this point. A Sphinx in Adopt Me. Oh, this one's awesome. If I just like adjusted the eyes slightly, which I will do right now. Yeah, maybe it doesn't look quite right. I have just asked the AI to go and create a monster in the style of Adopt Me. And what in the world have we just invented? This actually looks like something out of a possible nightmare and an actual Adopt Me pet. Like, this could be a real monster pet. This is really interesting. It also made me this, which looks creepy. I just asked for a Pokemon in the style of Adopt Me and it kind of looked like it's giving me a Pikachu with a just straight up an arrow for a tail. This one, this one definitely looks interesting. Now we're gonna try a hippo since Adopt Me doesn't have a hippo pet. Here's the first one, it does look like an Adopt Me pet I guess. Alright, this one is slightly terrifying. I asked for a few more hippos and this is what I got. But now the ultimate question, what would a cat robot look like in Adopt Me? Now this is interesting, so is this. How about a robot dog? I mean, Adopt Me already has the mecha pets, and they also already have like a basic robot, but a robot dog that looks like this, I think would be pretty cute actually. <coughs> what would happen if I upload a photo of my face? This might be terrifying. This is my original photo, and this is what it's done to me. What is this? These are all slightly terrifying. They have like drawn me- bro, what, what do they do to my nose? This one uh, looks like I am a zombie. This- they just don't look like me before and after. I look, um, cursed. Please remove this from my eyeballs. This is my YouTube thumbnail and I told it to turn me into Avatar. And you know what an Avatar is like from the movie? And um, it's definitely given me some interesting outcomes if I was a blue person. How about if I was anime? Let's have a look. Oh, oh wow. These, these are amazing. Do you like the Roblox logo in anime style? It just like changes each time. This one, this one's kind of interesting. I asked for a blue dragon and this is what it gave me. That's actually pretty cool. Ta-da! This looks like an actual, again, new update. If you want to check this out, head on over to Astroblox. There's tons of different things you could go and do on this. If you want early access to the app, go to astroblox.ai forward slash discord. Now click this video here to find out about the stupidest Roblox bans. And find out some silly reasons why you can get banned on Roblox.